welcome. This WSA and LIL model of the heliosphere, is used by the Space Weather Forecast Office to provide one to four day advance warning of solar wind structures and Earth directed coronal mass ejections that cause geomagnetic storms. Watch as the solar flare from the 24th heads toward Earth. It affects was registered today. On this Geoma Netosphere model, the increased pressure is observed today around 22:55 UTC time, coordinated universal time, which is 10:55 PM. You can easily see the wave of energy at the moment of impact. Now observed on the velocity model. The geospace ground magnetic perturbation maps display the gridded magnetic delta B, the animations show the model forecast, where the lead time depends on the solar wind speed, as well as the previous two hours for context. Regional disturbance model forecasts can be used by power grid operators to determine if disturbances are likely to have impacts at the general location. On this model the geoelectric field is a measure of the induction hazard to artificial conductors, such as electrical power lines, that results from geomagnetic activity, and can be used to estimate the amount of current induced by integrating along the conducting pathway. Here we see Central North America, has most of the activity. And as always, sit back, relax, and let me keep my eye, on the sun for you.